Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to McDonald's because it's somebody's birthday. So I'm gonna, I've already ordered on the app, so I'm gonna pull through drive through and uh, give them my code and pick it up and I'll tell you what all I got. Thanks for choosing McDonald's. What can I get you? Um, yeah, I have an online order. It's QJ72. Kevin? Yeah, that's it. Looks like we have that here if you'd like to pull on through. Thank you. Thank you. I like it that they actually give you a receipt even though you did it online. Um, even though you pull up, they're just verifying what you did. So, um, yeah, so they gave me a receipt. It's got my total and everything on. So it's, that's, that's a good thing. Because sometimes you order, you pre-order uh, on the app. They don't give you anything. You just, uh, you just pick your food up. You don't get any receipts or anything. Thank you. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Okay. Let's go park somewhere and we'll try this out. Okay, since it's Grimace's birthday, I looked it up. So Grimace was actually born in 1972 so he's as old as Tammy really old um it says the lovable love lovable the lovable spherical shaped purple character Grimace has always been one of McDonald's most recognizable faces Grimace was first introduced back in 1972 as evil Grimace I didn't know that I didn't know he was supposed to be bad I can't imagine if you look at Grimace he's goofy looking I mean I can't imagine him being evil um I guess then, then they came out with a hamburger or was the Hamburglar first? That'd be interesting. Uh, but anyway, the Hamburglar was evil. You know, he was stealing uh, the hamburgers and stuff. So I'm going to try their fries. I mean, it's McDonald's fries. Me and McDonald's fries have a love-hate relationship. If they're hot, I love them. If they, Even if they're slightly cooled off, I think they taste greasy and, and pasty. I don't like them. Those are pretty good. They got a good temperature on them. They're good and hot, good and salty. I don't have a problem with it. Okay. Someone looked it up for me. Um, the Hamburglar was actually introduced in 1971, so he's even older than Tammy. Um, the Hamburglar was just one of the residents of McDonald Land, and he was created along with uh, Officer Big Mac. I vaguely remember Officer Big Mac. I don't think you see that. Mayor McCheese, Grimace, and Captain Crook. I don't remember that one. As part of the 1971 McDonald's advertising campaign. Huh. Interesting. So, he's just a little bit older than uh, than Grimace. Again, the fries, they're good. Like I said, you're not really here to, to see this. But I want to just talk about these things. I don't even know if I've ever reviewed a Big Mac. I haven't had a Big Mac in a while. It's been a little while. And I probably did review it. I just don't remember. Just like I remember it, you get the... Um, the bread, it's very bready. I've always thought Big Macs were very bready. Not a lot of bread. Um, but you get two little, the thin hamburger patties and um, cheese and a McDonald's special sauce that's just dripping everywhere. Which is basically a thousand island dressing. 
It's still good though. Even after all these years, it's still um, it's still a good sandwich. It's uh, it's not my go-to sandwich. Like McDonald's Big Macs is not a sandwich I would like try it all the time, but it is a good sandwich, especially when you drop some on you. Gotta wipe it off your belly. Um, so overall, this meal still holds up even after all these years. It's still really, really good. So let me try the Grimace Shake. And like I said, this is supposed to be a mixed berry. Um, it's very, very soft, almost, almost runny. Honestly, it's very, very um, thin. Hmm. It's thicker at the bottom. So it's taking me a second to get it, um, any of it to drink it. So Grimace is a giant purple gumdrop like creature and Ronald McDonald's best friend in the McDonald's family of mascots. Generally depicted as happy, though a bit dim-witted. Yeah, that's what my memory of Grimace is. It's never been evil Grimace. Um, that berry is not bad. It's kind of like a mixture of blueberry and kind of like a blue raspberry, but not quite that strong. More blueberry than anything. Um, it's okay. It's not bad by any means, but it's not a flavor I would want to try I would not go back and get it again and again. So if this was a yearly shake, this is not one I would go, I wouldn't go back and say, ooh, I have to have one of those every year. It's okay, but it's not awesome. Um, I remember heard them inside while they were making mine. Uh, one of them, a couple of the McDonald's people were saying they didn't really like it very much. It's not that I don't like it. It's just that it's one of those flavors where you could live without it. I mean, it's, uh, a vanilla or a chocolate shake is, is, for me, is better than this is. So it's okay. Yeah, it has more of a blueberry flavor. It's got a little of a, kind of like a, a bite to it, like a bitterness to it. And it's the, I don't know if it's artificial flavoring or, or what, but it has a little bit of a, a harshness to it when you drink, when you actually swallow it. So um, the shake, I could definitely do without the, uh, um, I would probably give it, I don't know, I'll give it like a three and a half out of five. It's, it's just not my flavor for me. Um, the burger and fries though, if you get McDonald's fries hot, they're like a good solid four and a half out of five. I really do like them. Once they've gotten cold, they're like a zero. They're awful. Um, the Big Mac is good. Again, I like the more charbroiled, like Burger King kind of flavor or Wendy's or something like that. I like those kind of flavors better than the Big Mac, but Big Mac's a, a staple. It's been around forever and it's still a good sandwich. So, um, so yeah, good meal. I'm not gonna rate it necessarily, but I would definitely, if you haven't had Big Mac by now in your life, then. Uh, uh, maybe you just don't live near McDonald's because they're everywhere. So uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy this video and thanks for celebrating Grimace's birthday with me and I'll see you next time.